Good afternoon, one and all. Myself, Prashant Jana. Today, I'm presenting the Dendrimer Sensing Platform. Dendrimer Sensing Platform for the mycotoxin. Dendrimer. Dendrimer first uh, synthesized in 1985 by Donald and Tomario. Dendrimer is a unique nanostructure, uniform monodispersed nanostructure, which fascinates the surface modification, tunable opportunity. Uh, Tunable optical, chemical, and physical properties, and spatial opportunity to host gas interaction of chemistry. So this is general structure of dendrimer. Here, this graph is showing the patented application in dendrimer. Here, uh, I can see the biomedical applications is showing very, uh, very application, uh, patented application. But uh, I found the least application of uh, patents in forensic science. Uh, this I use by uh, US patent database. So my prime focus is to introduce the dendrimer in forensic science field. Mycotoxin. Mycotoxin is secondary metabolite from fungi. And uh, it is a uh, dangerous uh, byproduct or toxic metabolites. Uh, which can be uh, before, during, after harvesting the crops and the contamination of the uh, contamination in food products. Here, uh, Aspergillus species uh, is producing aflatoxin. The more than 20 aflatoxin is uh, produced by it, but most of the toxic uh, uh, effect of the aflatoxin is uh, listed here. And uh, this is the list of FSSSI limit is uh, provided. Here, uh, furim furimus is uh, provided don uh, after uh, don toxin and aspergillus and penicillin uh, penicillin species is provided okra toxin A. It's a uh, produced uh, toxin. Uh, here's sensing platform for mycotoxin. Uh, very frequently used to platform I am presenting here uh, is uh, optical sensing and uh, electrochemical sensing. So in uh, optical sensing is a uh, fluorescence based uh, sensing, which is a uh, spectrofluorometer is showing here uh, and colorimetric based uh, chemo illumination based sensor and surface enhanced uh, surface enhanced Raman spectroscopy based sensor. This is Raman spectroscopy. And uh, in electrochemical sensor, the voltammetric electrochemical sensors and conductometry and potentiometry. So uh, here I am focusing on voltammetric electrochemical sensors. This is cyclic voltammetry, which is a, a instrument. And this is the electrochemical cell. And uh, this three R electrode, which is used in the electrochemical cell. There is first is working electrode. Glassy carbon is mostly used. In this, uh, this one is a reference electrode where it, uh, silver is used, and uh, this is a counter electrode which is mostly used platinum, and this is electrolyte. And many electrolyte is reactive in the atmospheric, so we are uh, inserting the nitrogen. So we are adding pre bubbler to same electrode. So pharma then rimer based cry AB. Uh, sensing. So uh, here we are uh, in this study. They are created electrodes based on indium tin uh, oxide. This is uh, indium tin oxide uh, is coated by Pamamam AU and CDLC nanostructure, and then they are uh, binded with uh, uh, antibody and BSA and cry protein. So they created they fabricated this uh, electrode at uh, and they analyzed with. Uh, P, uh, PBS as an electrode and uh, electrolyte and at a 7.4 pH. So they find the uh, 3 picogram up to this uh, is lower limit of detection. And uh, here when we are, they are analyzing the linear graph photocurrent to the concentration, they are finding the uh, concentration increasing, the photocurrent is decreasing. And uh, this uh, cry one AB is the bacillus species is uh, produced, and this is the one of the species which is producing cry uh, protein. And this is toxic to insect, but not toxic to human. So this can act as a um, uh, act as the insecticide, and this crops are good for uh, higher yield. 
So BT corn is one of the which is uh, providing this uh, protein. And uh, some BT cotton and BT crops are very famous for uh, as insecticides, but not uh, toxic to human. Pamamam dendrimer, uh, aptomer based biosensor for aflatoxin B1. So here they are uh, coated on gold. So they modified uh, mercaptoid un unoccurdon, uh, unoccurdon exceed uh, on pamamam dendrimer with uh, coated with cysteine, which is immobilized on an uh, aptomer. So uh, this electrode is can detect uh, uh, 0.4 nanomolar concentration. This is very less and which is uh, lower than the uh, permissible limit. Here the, the oxidation property is showing here and uh, this is a reduction, a reduced reduction property of this uh, graph is showing in uh, cyclic voltammetry. We can uh, see the cycle of the oxidation reduction based uh, uh, redox reaction. We are finding the reference electrode is silver. A, and the bare electrode is showing this response. Uh, the system systemine is showing this response, which is less. And the pamamam dendrimer is showing the less response than bare electrode. Uh, this is aptamer, and uh, then nanomolar aflatoxin is also showing similar concentration. And here. It's uh, up to minus 20 voltage. The reduction profile is reducing with increasing the uh, concentration of aflatoxin. So this uh, sensing up to 0.4 is uh, showing lower limit of uh, detection, 0.4 nanomole. Uh, Pamamam dendrimer abdominal based biosensor for uh, aflatoxin M1 in milk products. Uh, here, amino modified DNA aptamer is used with pamamam dendrimer. Nu uh, uh, it's protein which coated on gold. So, this modified uh, dendrimer in this study, they use uh, two uh, electrodes. That is, uh, the changes uh, biotin they use instead of amino groups. So, uh, they check the, the both are lower limit. Uh, they found 8.47 in amino modified and uh, biotin they found 8.6 nanogram per liter aflatoxin they found m1 uh, here the oxidation property is uh, very clearly showing the uh, different concentration first uh, there is a bare there is a no concentration of aflatoxin is a higher and reducing in the oxidation property here we can find up to the 8.49 concentration there is a there is a reduction is uh, shown, but after that we are not finding the re reducing in the oxidation property. Here, pamamam based sensor for uh, don uh, toxin. AU is uh, coated on cysteine and pamamam then driver and monoclonal uh, antibody is coated on that uh, electrode. Uh, and this uh, this cyclic voltammetry graph we can see very easily the oxidation property and difference in reduction property. So uh, this is the lower limit of detection is a 10, 10 uh, ppb. Uh, here, all the graphs are very clear. We can see the blank and uh, the other one, uh, increasing the concentration 0 0.01, 0 0.005, 0 0.1, and uh, 0 0.5, and 1 ppm. And the list 5 ppm they checked in this reference conclusion uh, there is high demand for developing the rapid sensitive and focused technology for mycotoxin detection at lower concentration and dendrimer is one of the most effective sensor for detecting mycotoxin this review focus solely on curtain age sensor for mycotoxin particularly on dendrimer thank you